Noel, uh, victory over Finland, um, last kick of the game, so we, we left it a bit late tonight. Yeah, it's, it's true, we left it late, but uh, it's a game I thought we dom dominated, um, in particular the second half. Um, but as I slightly said, it was very, very late, very, very late. Um, and, but I always felt we were going to win the game. I said to the, to the staff on the bench, I can see a 1-0 here. Um, but what pleased me tonight, really, like I said, you know, we know the, the situation with the squad and what have you. But what pleased me with the squad has put together overnight, if you like, is the way they apply themselves and they stuck to the task, um, stuck to the plan. And, you know, I said to them there, for, for the new lads, Internet, welcome to international football because teams, no matter who they are, they're not going to lie down for you. Um, sometimes people watch our senior team and what have you and think that you know we should be turning Moldovas or, or you know Andorras over big scores and whatever. And I keep saying to the lads, it doesn't happen at international level, no matter what level. You know you've got to earn the right. And you mentioned the new players. You could tell obviously there were quite a few new faces in there. Whereas Finland are in full flow, going for their qualifying stages. They're, they're at their strongest tonight. Yeah. And you know, and you know, to be honest, I'm not really concerned about the opposition sometimes, you know, because uh, this game was a game where we took the opportunity to look at a few, look at a few uh, fresh faces, um, and they all acquitted themselves very, very well um, in, in the main. Um, and plus, you know, the likes of Lundstrom, you know, people like that, um, you know, Jordan Pickford and Blair got been around the scene. Again, they did very, very well. Um, so some really pleasing things tonight um, in a tight game, you know, and sometimes. As a coach, I prefer these kind of games as against the games where you know you're beating people four and five nil because you learn more about people in these type of situations. Because this could have been a qualifying game, um, you know. For example, if, when we played Ukraine in, in Estonia early in the, early in the campaign here, um, that kind of game, rather than us conceding and have to go and score the last minute to get a, to get a one-one, you know, you take that one nil and you dug in, and that's what they did tonight. So it's little things, le 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 learning steps for, for all of us, myself included. Um, and I was really pleased with the way that our lads applied themselves in, in, at the end of it. And two of the lads you mentioned, the debutants, have been playing regular first team football in, in League One. Um, obviously, to come into youth international football is slightly, slightly different, so it can take sometimes a, a little while to get used to it. Yeah, and, you know, I, as I said to the lads there, you know, it's it's almost like going back to the first day of senior school from a junior school. It's a different kind of it's a different sort of situation. You know, League One football, yes, is a different to men's game, but international football is different, um, different ways of playing. And you know, the situation the lads have got to get used to playing with different people they've not met before, or let alone played with before. You know, so sort of, they've been together since um, when we met up, I think it was Saturday evening, and here they are Tuesday night playing together for, for the country. You know, so I have to be pleased with them, and I am pleased with them. Of course, John Lundstrom was captain, he kept his cool at the end with a penalty, but he was quite, quite a driving force throughout the game. I thought, you know, you know me, I'm not one to, you know, normally singling people up, but I thought he was terrific tonight. I thought he, he was the captain. In, in, every, in every sense of the word, um, he, you know, with one, or two, with one or two others as well, he kept the team going, and with one of our, ex, you know, he's one of our most experienced players in the group, um, and he showed up tonight.